Okay, now uh, here we have a very interesting and conceptual question. Question conceptual hai, to definitely interesting to hoga. Question hai, the foot of the perpendicular from a point on the circle having equations x square plus y square is equal to 1 and z is equal to 0 to the plane having equation 2x plus 3y plus z is equal to 6 lies on which plane? These two equations together represent a circle. Uh, we have x square plus y square is equal to 1 and z is equal to 0. z is equal to 0 means uh, uh, points points lie on the x y plane. Okay? So, we consider variable point p having coordinates x y and 0 on x y plane x y plane ke jo bhi point hoga uska z coordinate 0 hoga okay and uh, we have x square plus y square is equal to 1 so we have uh, uh, root x square plus y square is equal to 1 clearly this is distance of point p from the origin origin has coordinates 0 0 and 0 distance between these two points is root x square plus y square okay so uh, this is uh, these two equations together represent a circle on the xy plane. Uh, center of circle is origin and radius is 1. Okay. We do find the uh, curve on which uh, foot of perpendicular from point on this circle to this plane lie. Diagram draw karke uh, Here we have a uh, uh, plane plane 2x plus 3y plus z minus 6 is equal to 0 okay? and uh, we have this circle, circle lies on the another plane, okay, na? circle ka plane or ye plane uh, dono alag alag planes hai, okay? now from the points on this circle we draw perpendiculars to this plane, okay? we have feet of perpendiculars, we join this points, okay? we have this curve, we do find equation of this curve. Hamei square ka equation nikalna hai. Uh, basically, we have to find the equation of orthogonal projection of this circle on this plane. Ye jo circle hai, hamei uh, is circle ka is plane ke upar orthogonal projection nikalna hai. Orthogonal projection means uh, uh, when we have a source of light uh, just above the circle, means perpendicular to the plane. Thik hai na? Hame is curve ka equation nikalna hai, this curve lies uh, uh, on this plane, curve is plane ke upar hoga, to locus kaise nikalenge is curve ka, equation kaise nikalenge. We have a variable point uh, P on the circle, having coordinates x, y and 0. Kya karenge? We know how to get coordinates of uh, foot of perpendicular from a point on the plane. To find the uh, equation of locus, we consider coordinates of point P as uh, cos theta, sin theta and 0. Le sakte is se points, thikye? x is cos theta and y is sin theta. Okay? And to get the equation of this curve, to get the equation of locus, we will eliminate theta. Locus ke equations ka strategy hota hai, tarika hota hai. We introduce some variable uh, and then we eliminate the variable. If variable is not given, we introduce the variable and eliminate it. Okay. Now, foot of perpendicular from point P on the plane is Q. Okay. Then, uh, coordinates of Q will be, suppose coordinates of Q are coordinates of point Q are alpha, beta and gamma. Okay, then using the formula, uh, we have uh, we have alpha minus cos theta over 2 is equal to beta minus sin theta over 3 is equal to gamma minus 0 over 1 is equal to minus. Uh, we put this coordinates in the expression, uh, in the expression uh, 2x plus 3y plus z minus 6. Okay. So, uh, we have here uh, 2 cos theta plus 3 sin uh, theta uh, minus 6 over 4 plus 9 plus 1, uh, 14. Okay. Now, uh, we have to eliminate theta. Theta ko eliminate karna hai. To kya karenge? We will get values of uh, uh, cos theta and sin theta 
in the form of alpha, beta and gamma. Okay. From this comparison, from this comparison we get 14 alpha is equal to 10 cos theta minus uh, 6 sin theta plus 12 and from this comparison we get 14 beta, 14 beta is equal to uh, minus uh, 6 cos theta uh, plus 5 sin theta plus 18. Now, you check the calculations. Okay. Now, what do you do? Now, here we have used alpha and beta. Okay. Uh, we got alpha beta in the form of cos theta and sin theta or uh, we can use beta and gamma or uh, uh, alpha and gamma. Here we are using alpha and beta. Okay. Uh, we have uh, two equations in cos theta and sin theta. What do you do? Our aim is to eliminate theta. So, what do you do? We find the values of cos theta and sin theta and use cos square theta plus sin square theta is equal to 1. Um, cos theta sin theta ki values lying kya karenge? Thoda muskil hai. Calculations jada hai. We multiply this equation by 5 and this by uh, 6 and add. Okay. Uh, we get uh, uh, 70 alpha plus uh, 14 6 ja, uh, 84. 84 uh, beta is equal to uh, we have here 50 cos theta 50 cos theta uh, minus uh, 36 cos theta 14 cos uh, theta plus uh, this uh, we will have yes uh, 60 is ko 5 se multiply kare 60 60 uh, uh, 60 plus uh, uh, 108 60 plus 108 is 168 okay now each term is divisible by uh, 14 uh, chalo ye achhi baat hai so, we equation milega, we get uh, 5 alpha plus 5 alpha uh, plus uh, uh, 6 uh, uh, beta uh, is, equal to, is equal to cos theta uh, plus uh, this is uh, 1, uh, 2, 12. Okay. So, we got the value of cos theta. Uh, cos theta is equal to 5 alpha plus 6 beta minus 12. Okay. Similarly, we get uh, value of sin theta uh, uh, if we eliminate cos theta or we can put this value of cos theta in one of the equations say uh, this one we get uh, uh, 14 beta is equal to minus 6 cos theta. Okay. So, we multiply this by minus 6 we get minus 30 alpha minus 36 beta uh, plus 72 plus 5 sin theta plus 5 sin theta uh, plus 18. Okay. Then we transfer all the terms on LHS except this and divide by 5. We get uh, 30 alpha over 5, uh, 6 alpha, uh, 50 beta by 5, uh, 10 beta. This sum is 90. So, we will have here minus 90 over 5 minus 18. This is sin theta. Okay. We got the values of cos theta and sin theta. Now, what do you do? Uh, we square and add, uh, we get, uh, we get, we square and add and then we replace alpha and beta with x and y respectively. Take it up. Ye variable point hai na, to kya karenge? Alpha, beta mein relation uh, jo aega, usme alpha ko x or beta ko y se replace karenge. We get, we get 5x, 5x uh, plus 6y minus 12 whole square uh, plus plus uh, 6x plus 10y minus 18 whole square is equal to 1. Okay. So, equation of circle will be uh, this and and abhi kaam khatam nahi hua hai. we have not related gamma. Gamma ko kaise relate karenge? Uh, this point lies on this plane. So, 2 uh, so two alpha plus 3 beta plus gamma minus 6 uh, will be equal to 0. Okay, so uh, we get uh, we get gamma is equal to gamma is equal to six minus two alpha minus three beta or z is equal to z is equal to six minus six minus two uh, x minus three y. These two equations together uh, represent uh, this curve, okay, which is orthogonal projection of this circle on this. Plane. So, a very fundamental question is uh, 
कहना पड़ेगा इस क्वेश्चन को जेई मेन में क्वेश्चन अच्छे फ्रेम होते हैं ठीक है 